This is A.E. Hoops. We're inside the UMBC Event Center. Head coach of UMBC men's basketball, Ryan Odom. Most of you know him by now. He's been in the league. This is your fourth season fourth coming season, up now, yeah. Ryan. Appreciate it. It's a beautiful facility right here. Uh, I know this has been ongoing in your time. This whole building was under construction when you got here. That's I'm right. Correct. Yeah, yeah. It actually was, it was just a, a pile of dirt when I first got here. And uh, it's amazing what we've walked into. I mean, it's a beautiful facility. The arena has been tremendous for the overall growth of our campus and our student athletes here. Obviously the practice facility here is great for men's and women's basketball and volleyball. We all share this and uh, it's become our home now. Let's take a little field trip, shall we? Let's do it. Can you give us a little tour? Yeah, absolutely. That's actually the old court from years ago. We're going to put that up outside here on the hall in, uh, in the hall. It's got the old Retriever logo. A little piece of history there. You know a little something about history. <laughs> it's remarkable. Was it difficult starting in a new arena mid-season, making that move? Yeah, I mean, it wasn't easy, uh, certainly, and we actually had a, a huge game. I mean, we were playing Vermont at that point, and uh, just worked out that the arena was going to be ready at that particular time. And uh, it was tough, you know, because I think we practiced maybe twice uh, at that point. And, uh, you know, but it was a special night. You know, you had the ribbon cutting and, and uh, certainly the, the arena was packed. You see the banners on the walls back there, women's basketball, men's basketball, 08. Then you look up, yeah, straight up ahead, the most magical moment in March Madness history. How often, I guess, are you reminded of that, obviously, playing here, the banners right above the court? Yeah, I mean, obviously, we're reminded every time we come in here, you look up, you see it, um, you know, and reminded of, of all the, you know, the hard work that that particular team put in to achieve something like that uh, was really, really special. And uh, you know, obviously, we still keep in touch with all the guys that were on that team that have since moved on. Several of them are still playing overseas you know, which uh, is exciting, you know, for us, you know, that, that was their goal was to be able to, you know, continue to play, you know, basketball after, after college and, and do it for a living. And, and we've got multiple guys doing that. This is coming up on the second anniversary of that monumental win in March Madness. Were you last year uh, watching March Madness? Unfortunately, I know you were watching, but like seeing your team, I'm sure you caught it on television. How cool is that? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we were certainly reminded of that game leading up to it, but we certainly were cheering for Vermont as well. I know they had a big game against Florida State and fared extremely well. And so you're always pulling for, for your conference photo or conference opponents, uh, you know, to, to do well. Um, you know, I think that's what's great about the America East is, is once it's decided and we have a team, you know, enter the field, everybody else is on board. Let's, let's pull for them to, to get a victory. And, uh, you know, for us, you know, the memories of that will live on forever. You know, one of the things that I'm most proud of is, is this past year's team, team's ability to kind of turn the page from that because there was a lot of expectation. Uh, a lot of folks still wanted to talk about it. And some of the guys, you know, weren't even a part of it. And uh, the way that they handled that was, was really, really good. You coached them right back to where they were a season ago, back in the championship game. We'll see what's up on tap for you guys this year. I know you're trying to get right back there, talk about regular season championship, maybe hosting the championship right here. But, Ryan, really appreciate the time. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Appreciate you coming down. This is AE Hoops.